question of which way does an enzyme read in DNA replication, transcription and translation always leads to a lot of confusion. Sometimes it's 5' prime to 3' prime end. Sometimes it's 3' prime to 5' prime end. So I'm going to try and settle that confusion now. Here is some badly drawn DNA. This is our 5' prime end. This is, same piece, our 3' prime end. Now if we imagine this DNA is separated, the two strands. Here's our DNA unwound, our 5' prime end, 3' prime. When DNA polymerase 3 or RNA polymerase attaches, it attaches at this end and it reads in this direction, creating either a new strand of DNA or creating a piece of mRNA. So it is reading in the 3 to 5 end. This means because of the anti-parallel nature, if this is our DNA, then our mRNA is created from 5 prime to 3 prime. Here is our mRNA. Now when this goes to translation, our ribosome attaches at this end and works along in this direction. So now we say, hold on, our mRNA is being read by our ribosome in a 5 to 3 direction. So when we first look at this, the DNA is read in a 3 to 5 direction, the mRNA is read in the 5 to 3 direction, this is happening in opposite direction. But when we look at it again, while the 3 to 5 and 5 to 3's are the same, it's being read in this direction here. It's being read in this direction here. So while we say DNA is read by in 3 to 5 direction by the DNA polymerase 3 or RNA polymerase, and the mRNA is read in the 5 to 3 direction, in reality they're both being read on this diagram from left to right.